So this is what happens when we actually put the whole thing back together and we take every event that we've talked about and every little detail that can, that can be present in any element of the scoring system and come back to the arena view and show you everything that's happening all at once. Thousands of service poles running, POVs being thrown against everyone. Some of them landing, we can see the colored rings occurring. We can see individual teams receiving benefits, receiving scores from those POVs that they're throwing against each other. And we can even see uh, every one of the patches being rolled out. And some of them are starting to suffer availability constraints or availability issues. So in instances like this, where this has shrunk to nearly nothing, and yet POVs have been thrown, there, that team is getting very, very little benefit from that. We can see that some of the services themselves still have their white borders. They've still not had a proof of vulnerability thrown against them. Those teams that have that in place and that the tile is full size are getting full points for security and full points for availability, but in most instances have no POVs thrown successfully, except for example, CRS3 here, which has basically scored a perfect score for this service on this round. And all of this is immediately discernible from these events that are occurring every round.